All right, I've had a few requests to look at today's Nerdle because they said it was hard. So I'm just gonna start with my usual 12 plus 35 equals 47. Okay, so we got a bunch of the stuff, but it's in the wrong spot. Okay, so the equals is not here. So we could be equaling a single digit. It seems like in Nerdle, it's more likely to equal a three digit number, maybe like a two digit times a single digit because we don't have addition here. We could do a two digit times a single digit equals a three digit. That would be good. So something like, I don't know, maybe 54, right? Because we got to use a five and a four times, well, times three is going to be something in the hundreds. So that's not going to work. We could do like times, times six would be something in the three hundreds and we have a three. Okay. What's 54 times six is 324. That could be good. We've got a three and a two, a five and a four, and equals. Seems like a reasonable second guess anyways. Okay, let's go with that. Okay, so 50, it is 54. Oh, it's not times. Oh, and it's not equals. So it has to be equals a single digit. Okay, so we're doing subtraction maybe? No, because it would be a three digit minus a two digit if we were doing subtraction. So it's got to be division. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is going to be a three digit divided by a two digit equaling. A, so this is an equals. This is a three, five and four. Okay, let's put those in there. And then I think it's going to be a division like this. There's no six. The two, I mean, we could do 542. Uh, and we've got to have, and we can't divide by 53. We could divide by like 43 or something. So I think over here, we can't have a four or a seven or a one or a six. I mean, it could be like an eight or a nine. What about like nine times, we're in the 500s, nine times, oh, we can't do six though. Is that gonna, what's nine times 53? That would be, no, that's not gonna be, that's not gonna get us into the 500s. So maybe not nine then, maybe we need to do like eight here and, but we can't do seven there either. We can't do six or seven anywhere. And this could be a five, but we have to have a two in one of these spots. If this is two, no, it can't be two because you'd have to have, I mean, 500 divided by two is never gonna be a two digit number, 500 anything. So it can't be a two there. So this has to be the two, it's gotta be 542. And so we're dividing by, and so it's gotta be like five, eight and nine somehow, but nine and eight is gonna be too big. Five and nine isn't gonna be, big enough five and eight definitely isn't gonna be big enough so if you do eight here and five there that's only 415 so that tells me it's not three digit divided by a two digit it's got to be okay so we're doing subtraction and division that's what we're doing so we're gonna divide then subtract Okay, so it's 54 divided by, we could do 54 divided by nine would be six minus three would equal three. That seems good, let's go with that. Oh, but not subtract. Oh, so, so add. So 54 divided by nine. Okay, so 54 divided, no, we're not add. Divided by nine divided by three. Oh, so it's 54 divided by nine is six divided by three equals two. Oh, right, we had to have the two. I didn't have a two, okay. I should have figured that out because we had the, the, the two up here. It should have known the two, okay. Anyways, this is what it has to be now. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that was a tricky one for sure. Um, very interesting, divided and divided again. So, pretty cool. So let me know how you did with today's Nerdle, and especially, did you have to use all four operations in order to figure out it was division twice, like I did? Or did you figure out it was division twice some other way? Or how did it work out for you? And be sure to subscribe for more puzzles.